might make a little bit more sense. So basically, ladies and gentlemen, as we discussed in this example, the first thing we want to do is isolate our logarithm. So the first thing we're going to do is isolate our exponential. So we're going to divide by negative 2. In this case, I have e to the x equals positive 5. Has everybody followed me so far? OK. Now, again, we're trying to solve for x, right? But in this case, when we're trying to solve for x, we need to get that off the bottom. So I need to get rid of that e base to the e. So using this thinking, I have my base is e. So therefore, I'm going to have to take the log of base what? E, which is natural log. So I'll take ln. We don't really write the base e, but we can. I'm going to write it in there so you guys can see. So if we, if we have a base that's e, we have to use ln. You're going to use the natural logarithm ln, yes. It represents the same thing. It's the same thing as log base e. ln is just, it's just the way that we use our natural logarithm to represent the, that. Okay. So now we have ln base e of e raised to the x. We know that gets simplified to what? 1. Now we can Then I have ln base e of 5, which is really just ln of 5. We don't need to write the base e. So what is ln base e of e? Well, uh, or I'm sorry, ln, um, ln of 5. Well, you have to go to your calculator. And again, ln is base e. So I don't need to write an ln. So I just type in ln. One another thing that, oh, I thought I went over this with you guys. Log base 10 of x is equal to log of x. We don't write the 10. In your calculator, it just says log. It doesn't say base 10 of log. I know. It's the same thing. No, it says 10 on there. No, in your log button, it doesn't say base 10. That's what I'm trying to tell. Same thing. Ln of x is the same thing as, oh, I'm sorry, ln e of x is just ln of x. We don't need to write in the e. Okay, so what I'm telling you is when you have ln of x, that is base e. But in my calculator, I'm just going to type the ln button and then of 5, which gives me 1.61. So x is approximately 1.61 when I round it. And notice again how I use the approximate. Ln 